The World Poker Tour has enacted a number of changes for its ninth season, including the return of Kimberly Lansing as anchor, the introduction of the Royal Flush Girls, Matt Savage as executive tour director, and most recently, Tony Bond 18 Dunst as host of the new segment called The Raw Deal. We caught up with him to learn more. Hey everyone, I'm here with Tony Dunst, the new host of The Raw Deal. Please tell us what that entails. Well, Julio, what's going to happen is I'm going to pop up once or twice an episode and really just get a moment to speak on whatever I'd like to about probably about the strategy of a hand that we just witnessed or perhaps something that's going on in the episode as far as players' conduct, behavior, and what's going on in poker in general. Now you have a blog and card player. You're known for telling it like it is. Are you going to do the same on the show? Uh, I, I certainly hope so, and I've been encouraged to do precisely that. You're going to make some people cry? I don't intend to make people cry. I'm just going to say whatever occurs to me. You know, generally I, I like to think that I'm not extremely rude about the blunt things that I say, and so someone ends up crying, they're probably way too sensitive. All right, well, it seems like there's like a, a sense of like a resurgency here at the World Poker Tour. Is it, does it have to do with you, maybe the Royal Flush Girls? What, what, what's the deal? I would certainly give the credit to the Royal Flush Girls before I gave it to me. I really don't think I'm a big pole uh, yet. But, you know, it's good to see that the prelims are getting better numbers. We're seeing some really good value in the field. And uh, above all, it's just a fun time at the Bellagio again. We're joking around the table. I iced Lucky Chewy. As you, as you have to do when you, when you end up with Chewy at your table, and he arrives late. And he iced me this summer before a World Series event, so it was down. But, um, you know, above all, I, I think that people are, are starting to get excited for the World Poker Tour again, and they've made some really good changes and adjustments, and I certainly think that bringing the buy-in down to 10K was a great move. So, here we are. All right, I'll let you go get back to your duties. No worries. Thanks, Julio. Dunst is still in the main event, along with 287 other players who have bought in so far. Stay tuned to Card Player TV for more updates on the 2010 WPT Festival Lago main event.